We have 30,000 days on Earth if we live a normal lifespan, 32, 33,000, something like that. Each day then becomes finite and is sort of not to be lost in the process. My friend said, I met the nicest guy last night. His name is Robert, he's from St. Louis, and Susan got this kind of like, oh, I was born there. He went home after that and he wrote this poem called For Susan the Dancer and talking about a young girl dancing with her father and that's how they communicated. And it just blew me away and I thought, wow, maybe this guy has some sensitivity and some caring and some intelligence. When I first met Susan, I'd been through bad marriages that ended in divorce. I had a son from my first marriage, a daughter from my second marriage. Here was a person that was interested in opening a relationship that did not have an interest in marriage. When we were in New York on 9-11, I realized I was gonna be in this relationship, I wanted to be in this relationship, I wanted it to be better. He accepts me for exactly who I am. You know, he encourages me, which I don't think I've had a lot of that. I think we recognize the artistic qualities that each of us has, and I think we both have a deep respect for that. For me, it's finding the right word or the right phrase or the right metaphor or maybe even the right line break if it's poetry. For Susan, her artistry comes out in virtually everything she does physically, whether it's her own individual efforts with trapeze or with aerial yoga to perform a certain function or handstand or backflip or whatever it is. And she'll stay on it and on it and on it until she gets it down. Being in the moment with movement, hitting it just right, it is like being weightless. If I'm really feeling low, all I have to do is go out and move a little bit, and suddenly I am in so much of a better place. I like being with her. You know, that creates value. That's how I want to spend my time. I still pinch myself. Whoa, have I been with this person for that long? How could that be? You know, and I just don't see anybody out there better than Robert for me. I really don't. She's never seen the Grand Canyon. I want to take her to see the Grand Canyon. 